Supreme Court. She is also in damage control mode after Rajya Sabha MP Jawad Sirkar offered to resign from his parliamentary position over the Ajika rape and murder horror. The Trinamool Congress chief is said to have spoken to a party MP Jawad Sirkar over the phone and heard his grievances in detail. Jawad Sirkar has refused to take back his resignation, saying that his decision to quit politics is final. On Sunday, Sarkar had written a letter to Mamata Banerjee highlighting his party's failure in handling the case and the corruption within the party. The TMC MP in his letter had stated that the public outrage over rape reflects the growing discontent within the TMC government and the party has lost trust of the people. In his letter, Sirkar had also highlighted the unchecked attitude of the favoured few and the corrupt within his own party. Let's go back to Shreya, who is joining us live at this point and covering the story for the past month. Shreya, this is quite embarrassing here because this is now the second Trinamool Congress MP to publicly express his dissent against the Trinamool uh, government's handling of this entire crisis. First, it was Sukhendu Shekhar Rao. Now, it is Javaya Jawa Sikar, who in his letter has made it very clear that he's quite disappointed with the way the party has handled the case and this aftermath. And even after Mamta Banerjee has personally reached out to him, he is in no mood to and take back his resignation. Well, of course, uh, this is the third MP, in fact, to react to the Ajikar incident. First, it was Shantanu Shane. After he made certain comments, he was removed as the spokesperson of the TMC party. Then it was Shikhandu Shekhar Roy who have joined the protest. And then we saw that it is Jawahar Sirkar. Remember, he has tendered his resignation yesterday. And in the letter that he has sent down to Chief Minister Mamta Banerjee, he clearly says that when I joined the party, I had tell tales of corruption of the TMC party that was related to the former education minister. But then I told myself that no party comes without the corruption part. But now when the entire Ajikar incident is happening, he says that he is shocked by how the administration and the state government is handling the entire case. says that I thought Mamta Banerjee is going to intervene directly. We will see the old Mamta Banerjee, but that was not the case. And he says that the protest is mounting people from all walks of life. They have joined the protest. And he He's clearly not happy. He clearly says in the letter, I cannot do with a corrupt officer. I simply cannot do. So we see Jawahar Sarkar, he tenders his resignation, talks about the corruption inside the party and how the government is not taking any step. Remember, after that, what our sources have told us is that there was a phone call conversation between Chief Minister Mamta Banerjee and uh, the MP where, uh, the, um, uh, you know, Mamta Banerjee have heard the grievances of the MP. But as far as Jawahar Sarkar is concerned, he is very much adamant. He says that he is not going to take his resignation back. All right, Shia, thanks a lot for joining us with those details. We'll keep coming back to you through the day to get more updates, both from within the Trinamool Congress as well as what is the latest reaction coming in from those doctors who continue to be on protest.